10 Must Watch Dramas Starring Xiao Zhan Xiao Zhan, born in 1991 in Chongqing, China, is a talented actor and singer. He first entered the entertainment industry through the singing competition show Ranshaba, Xiaonian. In 2016, he began his acting career with the drama Superstar Academy. However, his role in the hit drama The Untamed in 2019 propelled him worldwide fame, making him one of China's most sought-after stars. Although he excels in singing, Xiao Shan has been devoted to theater and TV drama in recent years. So join us today. We will explore Xiao Shan's journey in the entertainment industry through these 10 dramas showcasing his talent. Number 1. Superstar Academy A low-budget web drama that aired in 2016. In this series, he played the male lead, Fang Tianza. The plot of this show is funny and might seem a bit zany by today's standards, but it's worth checking out if you want to see Xiao Zhan's first foray into acting. Number 2. Oh! My Emperor. A costume romantic comedy that aired in 2018. It was filmed in 2001, and this drama follows the story of Luo Feifei, played by Zhao Lucy, who accidentally travels back in time to a fictional kingdom called Huangdao. Xiao Zhan stars as the second male lead, Beitang Moran, a royal prince who is cool and aloof but secretly devoted to the Luo Feifei. While this drama's plot and production quality may not be outstanding, Xiao Zhan's refined and elegant appearance, coupled with his relatively natural acting, helped him stand out and paved the way for better film and television opportunities. Number 3, The Untamed. Aired in September 2019. 16 years ago, the world was divided into five major clans with the Wen clan at the top and the other four clans suffering under its dominance. Among the youth, Wei Wuxian, son of an old friend of the Jiang family, possessed a cheerful personality. He became acquainted with Lan Wangji, a disciple of the Lan family in Gusu known for his elegance and integrity, and the two became close friends. And then a tortuous series of events ensued. The storyline of The Untamed is tortuous and infused with traditional Chinese elements and customs, presenting viewers with an incredible ink painting-like visual experience. Wei Wuxian, the main character, overcomes challenges while remaining true to his original intentions, embodying the heroic spirit of a young man dedicated to helping the people, resonating with today's youth. Initially, the drama was not well received due to the cast comprising all newcomers. However, it eventually became popular, especially due to Xiao Zhan's outstanding portrayal of Wei Wuxian, a mischievous and heroic character who is the soul of the entire drama. The drama's rating on Dubon, a popular Chinese review site, reached 8.4 points. Still, it decreased to 7.3 for some inexplicable reasons before stabilizing at 7.7, .7, which is remarkable considering the immense number of viewers who rated it, totaling 1.645 million. It's evident that viewers don't hold back in praising good work. The original novel featured a homosexual love story, but the drama portrayed the relationship between the two main characters as a deep and loyal friendship, which didn't detract from the drama's overall storyline and framework. It's worth noting that China has banned the production of dramas featuring homosexual love stories, or adaptations of homosexual novels, making The Untamed a historical and significant production. Number 4, The Wolf. Aired in November 2020, the drama tells the love story between Princess Xiaoxing of Kuizhou County and a boy who grew up in a wolf pack. After eight years of separation, they meet again and fall in love. Xiao Zhan plays Ji Chong, the lively and carefree prince who exudes confidence. However, did you know this drama was filmed in 2017, even before Oh! My Emperor and The Untamed? At the time, Xiao Zhan had just entered the entertainment industry and had little formal acting experience besides a low-budget web drama called Superstar Academy. In an interview, he revealed that The Wolf was his first real acting experience and taught him how to face the camera and interact with his co-workers. This drama was a huge leap for him, elevating his skill level from 0 to 40 or 50 points. He said the process was difficult, 
he had to film during the day and take acting classes online at night. He even broke down several times due to the pressure, but he persevered and wrote down his thoughts on acting while crying. It was truly heart-wrenching to see. He sometimes doubted himself, questioning whether he was cut out for performance. But thankfully, his strong sense of discipline and perseverance helped him push through. Without his hard work, we wouldn't have been able to see his portrayal of Wei Wuxian or witness how outstanding he is today. In fact, the drama had a strong cast, featuring popular leads Wang Dalu and Li Qin, as well as stunning scenery and impressive martial arts. And it was especially highly anticipated after Xiao Zhan became famous. Unfortunately, Xiao Zhan's career was suspended due to the 227 incident that a storm of negative rumors and malicious attacks, fueled by rival companies. To avoid further harm from the haters, the drama was suddenly released in November 2020. It shocked everyone when the drama became hugely successful in just one month, ranking 8th in the effective annual views on major streaming platforms. It also reached first place on two platforms and second place on another. The drama garnered over 677 million views. Undoubtedly, this drama helped Xiao Zhan make a comeback and return to the public eye. Number 5, Dolua Continent, aired in February 2021. This is a fantastical and inspiring drama, an anime adaptation. It tells the story of Tang San, who lost his mother at a young age and relied solely on his father. Despite facing numerous obstacles on his journey, Tang San perseveres with his determination and strength, uniting with friends to uphold justice and ultimately reaching the pinnacle of soul masters. Xiao Zhan plays Tang San exceptionally well, embodying the passionate and spirited young hero. While the drama may not be an exact replica of the anime version, the adapted storyline is tightly woven with impressive visual effects. The hard work and teamwork themes showcased in the drama make it a good choice for children and young adults. Number 6, Ace Troops, aired in December 2021. It is a military drama spanning 40 years. It tells the story of young soldiers who train and grow into the best of the best, becoming the Ace Troops. Xiao Zhan plays Gu Ya, a handsome and imposing figure with strength and attitude, yet also sensitive and perceptive, resonating with many audiences. It's worth noting that during the filming of this show in August 2020, Xiao Zhan had just experienced a difficult time due to the 227 incident, almost losing all of his business and entertainment resources. He had to work harder to isolate himself from external noise and maintain a peaceful mindset to perform stably. On his Weibo account, he mentioned that Guia helped him through happy, sad, confused, and yearning times. However, he didn't mention that it was his persist in that injected fresh blood and soul into Guia, transforming him from a character on paper into a flesh and blood soldier. The drama performed exceptionally well, achieving the highest TV ratings in 63 cities on the first day without any promotion, with a viewership rating of 2.633% and a market share of 8.335%. Showcasing Xiao Zhan's colossal appeal. Number 7. The Oath of Love. Aired in March 2022, Gu Wei, played by Xiao Zhan, and Lin Jixiao, played by Yang Zi. One is a handsome male doctor, and the other is a lovely college student. These two people know each other at first because of the sudden illness of Lin Jixiao's father. After that they slowly approached each other and finally became the brightest star in each other's darkness. In this drama, the love between the hero and heroine is like in real life and emotion. And it is precisely this kind of story that touches our hearts the most. The drama was filmed in 2019 but won't air until 2022. Because Xiao Zhan and Yang Zi are the top stars in China, the ratings of this drama are outstanding. It's been the top one on the TV channel for 12 consecutive days. And the views counts on the internet exceeded 100 million for 18 straight days, reaching a maximum of 230 million in a single day. Number 8 The Longest Promise Set to air in 2023, an aloof and cold prince of Kongsang, Shireen, and the enthusiastic princess Chi tribe of Xuyan formed a fateful relationship because of grace. Still, they became masters and apprentices for three years due to a misjudgment. Later, Shireen mistakenly believed that the mermaid who accompanied Zhu Yan to grow up, Ji Yuan, was the sea emperor. So he killed Ji Yuan. In the end, Zhu Yan stabbed Shireen with a jade bone. This drama currently has more than 4 million reservations, which is much higher than other dramas. 
only because it starred Xiao Zhan. That's the appeal of top stars. This drama was already finished in August 2021 and was rumored to be released in the summer of last year. But there was no movement. However, it can be determined that this drama is a traditional fantasy theme from the release trailer. The costumes and martial arts are all conventional Chinese ancient fantasy styles. And the actors in the play have not released any negative news. Leave the broadcast is just a matter of time, and fans can wait patiently. Number 9 Where Dreams Begin set to air in 2023 The story takes place in 1970s Beijing and focuses on a group of young adults who are experiencing the prime of their lives. They include Xiao Chunqing, a youth from a traditional courtyard, and Tong Xiaomei, a Beijing girl who dreams of becoming a doctor. They go through major life events such as taking the college entrance exam, joining the military, and starting their own businesses all while forming friendships, romances, and navigating the ups and downs of fate during the era of China's reform and opening up. Through vivid character portrayals, the show captures a snapshot of life in that era. The trailer exudes a youthful vibe with props and costumes that bring viewers back to 1970s Beijing, such as bicycles, military coats, and twisted braids. Xiao Zhan plays the role of Xiao Chunqing, speaking with an authentic Beijing accent demonstrating his dedication to his character portrayal. The female lead is played by Li Qin, who has a pure and lively appearance and is widely recognized for her acting skills. This marks their fifth collaboration but the first time as a couple. Number 10. Sunshine by My Side. Set to air in 2023. Renowned ad director Jian Bing, who has just ended a failed marriage, meets a young newcomer Xing Yang at a restaurant and thus begins their journey of love and understanding. However, reality proves to be a hindrance as they face differences in background, family opposition, and office gossip. How will Jian Bing and Xing Yang navigate through these challenges? With a workplace rivalry and a May-December romance, this show is definitely not one to miss. It's worth mentioning that Xiao Zhan, who had a cameo as a minor character in the film Monster Hunt, starring Bai Baiha, is now co-starring with Bai Baiha in this TV drama. Fans are amazed by how fate can bring people together, and it makes me realize that even the most successful stars had to work their way up from humble beginnings. Furthermore, Xiao Zhan's youthful appearance makes him a perfect fit for the role of a young professional. Xiao Zhan's journey in the entertainment industry has been full of ups and downs. Despite his commercial endorsement and acting success, securing the best resources in the fiercely competitive industry is no easy feat unfortunately, he still faces criticism from many haters who nitpick at every aspect of his career. They compare his acting skills with those of veteran actors, his looks with the most handsome men like Louis Ku, and even compare his muscles with those of a professional athlete. Some even unjustly blamed him because they didn't like the drama's plot. These critics refused to make fair comparisons. For instance, in The Untamed and Ace Troops, who can honestly say he acted worse than the other male lead. And while many young male stars still rely on dubbing, Xiao Zhan used his own voice in Ace Troops and The Oath of Love. Additionally, his appearance perfectly fits the aesthetic preferences of most people. Xiao Zhan has worked tirelessly to improve his craft by participating in theater and constant practice. Well, let's end this video with his own words.